Hi, Sag. How are you? Oh, my goodness. Kitty wants to say hello. Okay, Sag, first of all, um, it's time now. And you know this. You know it's time. You know it's time to do something. You know it's time. It doesn't even matter at this point anymore what you choose, how you do it. Um, the simple fact that it needs to be done now. And you know this. And the only thing that has kept you in your head is that you've been afraid to do it. All right. So whatever this is, Sag, you need to go ahead and do it. Also, Sagittarius, I did get... Oh, hi, Sag. How are you? Thank you for joining me. Thank you for sharing your energy with me. Don't forget we go live on Tuesdays. After all 12 signs, I do free reads. And we have the I Am Here Club on Thursdays. Okay, Sagittarius, there's some kind of maintenance that you need to take care of. All right? This can be on your physical body. It can be on your vehicle. There's something that needs to be taken care of, cleaned up. Maybe it's your house. I don't know, okay? But that was coming in very strong for you. You also need to go have some fun. All right, what are Sagittarius's potential blockages for this time? Besides a kitty trying to eat your arm. What are the... Please don't bite me. Thank you. Please don't claw me. Don't hurt me. Maybe you're asking, maybe you're afraid to make a decision because you don't want to get hurt. But in not making a decision, it is making everything worse. All right, in the window. Thank you. All right. There it is. Spirituality and religion along with orphan. Faith. You're not having faith. You're not having the faith that everything is going to work out. You don't, you're not, yeah. You feel separated from spirits. You feel like you're not sure how to believe. You're, you're not sure what to believe in, okay? Get yourself grounded because universe is here to help you. But if you don't get yourself grounded, it, it's not going to do any good. Connecting back with your faith, with your beliefs. Even if you don't know what they are, get curious about them. Explore. You know what? Just sit and, and be quiet for a few minutes, and that will help. Hug a tree. Sit in some grass, okay? Your blessings is independence and nutrition. Feeding anything that is not codependent is going to pay out in a way that you do not even see. Doing things in an independent nature. Sad, you're all about freedom. Doing things in an independent nature, feeding that curiosity that's in you is going to pay off, all right? All right, what is in Sagi's environment that they don't even know? Someone around you is not seeing the things the same way you are. I'll put it to you that way. All right. Nephilim. Controversial, assessing, and new perspectives. All right. The best way to stay out of this controversy is to, A, get yourself grounded. That's for sure. Keep a little bit more to yourself while you go through this transition because you are going through a transition, I feel, right now. You're about to have something pop off, okay? And I mean that in a good way. If you allow, you're going to have something pop off. You're going to get noticed. You're going to, okay? But you need to allow yourself to do that, taking a step back right now. Um, assess, get a new perspective on the situation. And this... What, wherever you've been having problems, there is a solution coming. You might need to get a new perspective, okay? All right. Going, meeting, doing. Kindred spirits does not mean that they have to be with you every step of the way. Seeing relationships in a different manner. Being a people pleaser instead of having healthy boundaries. All right. 
your community will celebrate with you once you're able to to do this once you're able to make a friggin decision and move forward with it all right now if you have an online presence or anything like that keep going you are going to be getting followers all right Who do you see long term? What do you see long term? Everyone is meant to have a different role in your life. Okay. Six of Swords, the Hermit, Knight of Wands, Nine of Wands, and the Seven of Pentacles. Slow movement forward is still movement forward, Sag. Going within, getting a higher perspective of the situation is going to give you the direction in which you need to go. And once you get there, it's a long road, love. You could very well be going on a journey. You're going on a journey one way or another. Okay, and it's going to bring you to a place where you have more patience and peace. Many times there are certain journeys we have to take alone. But trusting, going back to faith, right? Trusting in the universe. Trying not to do damage along the way. Releasing codependency and the need for the approval and love of others. Feeding anything that will bring you independence at this time is going to be very beneficial. And you will start to see the road ahead because not only is it going to come up and meet your feet, but it's going to start to become illuminated. Okay, Sag? But you do need to do something. There's something in your life that you need to take a step forward on. You know exactly what that is. And it's going to lead you to, to a place where you're going to feel so much more peaceful. So much less controversy. Anything that's bringing controversy to your life right now needs to be taken a step back from. You need to leave that. Okay? Getting a new perspective. Because others are t getting a new perspective on you. And don't worry about gossip. Do what is true for you. Do what is right for you at this time. Okay? Without leaving mayhem oh hello without leaving um mayhem in your wake and by that i mean if you're leaving a situation if it's work give two weeks notice if it's a relationship don't be cruel don't be mean but something needs to be left behind you do have someone either now or coming into your life that is going to be um, a partnership for you. Focusing on relationships that are partnerships. All right. You got the two of fire, your advice card. Power sharing. Mentorship. Partnership, equality, teamwork, mutual interests, ambition, and control. Align yourself with another. A power sharing situation. Two heads are better than one. A time for teamwork and cooperation. A struggle for power. Seek one who will teach much needed skills. An equal exchange of energy. Someone who will help you overcome obstacles. There's someone either coming into your life or that is already in your life that can 
that isn't equal to you. All right? They don't want to dominate and they do not want to be submissive. They want equal balanced partnership. And this is what you should be focusing on. Relationships that are equal and balanced. And that is what's going to help move you along. Because if they're equal and balanced, you still have your independence in them. All right? Okay, guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. See you Tuesday and Thursday. You know I love you. If you want a personal reading, email me. Peace to you. Ciao.